Hi again, everybody. I'm Philip Goodman. I'm Sabrina Karstensen. And we are from the Nevada Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group One Inc. in Reno, Nevada. Today, Sabrina and I will take a look back at the May 2019 real estate market activity in our state capital, Carson City, Nevada. If this is your first time watching our market reports, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell below. Lots of new videos coming out this summer that you won't want to miss. And if this is your first time, be sure to watch the past market reports so you can see how the market has been trending. All right, Sabrina, are you ready to take a look inside MLS and go on a tour of a very unique property in Carson City? Yeah, let's go. We are looking at Carson City, May 2019 on the top and Carson City, May 2018 on the bottom. Already pulled the data from the MLS and we have removed condos from this equation this month since there were only a handful and they were pulling down the averages and medians. And even with the condos out of this picture, nine more units sold in May than did in April and 12 more than May of 2018. The median price didn't change much from last month at just over 339,000, but this is up a whopping 43,000 from last May. The average price certainly went up from last year, and that's due to eight homes moving for more than $600,000. And that's an important figure because it's showing that buyers with lots of money are looking at Carson City just as much as they're looking in Reno and Tahoe. Carson City has just as much to offer as Reno does. Percent of asked received for May was a strong 99.2%, which is continuing up from March and April. And to see that April report, click the link you see in the upper right corner now. We are on our website again, crenohomesforsale.com for our featured property in Carson City, 1321 Longview Way. Sabrina, tell us about this very unique property. This property is $750,000. It has three beds, three baths, and 4,642 square feet. It sits on one acre and built in 1979. Fun fact, it was built by a movie producer. Sabrina, let's just go right to the bar. My favorite place, let's go. I'm so curious to know who this producer was because clearly he had a few friends over frequently. Well, whoever wants to go take a look at this property, I will do a little digging and I might let you know who it was. I love this home so much. It has such a classic feel. It has the old charm and you can either move in and just leave it the way it is and it'll be perfectly fine, or you can do the updates yourself and still maintain that classic feel. They don't make archways like that anymore. This is also some hand brushed stucco up here on the ceiling. That adds for a really nice textured effect when you walk in. Sabrina, here's more of that classic look you're talking about, a mix of hardwood, drywall, and brick. Absolutely, and you also have the high ceilings to where if you decided to update, you would have those high ceilings and it would have that modern feel. Another one of my favorite features of this property is the backyard and landscaping. All of those mature shade trees, you have that nice willow tree there that provides you a ton of shade under that gazebo. Um, you don't have to do a single thing to this yard. Except trim, mow, and rake. But that's the fun part. It really is. Well, to see more listings by the Nevada Real Estate Group, click the link you see in the upper right corner now. Well, there's your look back at the May 2019 real estate numbers for Carson City and Sabrina. Pretty cool to see a piece of Hollywood up here in northern Nevada. That home was so beautiful. Let's go look at that home together. And go sit at that bar, have a drink. Yes. Well, that'll do it for us here at the Nevada Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group 1 Inc. in Reno, Nevada. I'm Philip Goodman. I'm Sabrina Karstensen. We'll see you next month. Bye. Thank you.